So he could bring home fairy dust and see his daughter smile. How do you know that? I know a lot of things, Les. Where did you learn it? I can't remember. What are you doing out here? Oh, I need to be alone sometimes. I'm the same way. It's funny. You remind me of someone. Who? I don't know. That is funny. I like to wake up early in the mornings, do you? Yes. <laughs> and, uh, don't like cabbage that much. <laughs> I don't either. <laughs> seems we have a lot in common. It seems we do. We both like Connor. Connor? Don't you like him? You stay away from him, young lady, if you know what's good for you. I know his type. I know what he's after. What's it to you? Molly, you were named after your great-grandmother on your mother's side. You know my mother? Aye. She was my wife. You're, you're drunk. I've never been more sober, Molly. Molly! Your mother, Agrina, she gave birth to you 19 years and 21 days ago. On your second day of life, I slipped whilst carrying you. A stone cut you behind your ear. You are my father. I've been waiting for this moment all my life. And so have I. No one chases us here? We're safe and protected. There is food here. We don't have to beg or steal. For this we are thankful. We found a new home. Didn't I always promise? A place of bounty. A place... A place still possessed by the demons of war. This will be our challenge. There will be unpleasant tasks for us, as I've told you. But in the end... We will make it our home at any cost. An island of peace in a world of war. Doyle. I can't stay here. You've broken the circle. I want to go. Please. Then go. Please. Go. Live among them. Embrace their hatred and spit on Lisa's grave. I didn't mean to say anything bad about your wife. We must make Lisa's dream a reality. Child. child did they lie to you yes it's all right lisa they can't hurt us if we stay strong if we stay together we will have our home we have the courage to do what must be done the courage to hold on to what is ours the courage to kill, to live.
you doing? Burning my weapons. Fergus, you're mad. She doesn't want a warmonger as a father. So you told her then. Connor? I need to talk to you about Doyle. He's acting crazy. And the way he's got those children following him, it's not right. What is he trying to do? I think he's trying to help them. Is he? And his obsession with Molly? It's unnatural. Clearly, she's not his real daughter. She's mine. She's what? She's my daughter. What are you doing? Something I should have done years ago. My days as a warrior. with you. Is everything all right? No. You know how much I appreciate what you've done for me and the children. What's wrong? Your friend Fergus told Molly that he was her father. Why would he do such a contemptible thing? The poor girl is devastated. I've stayed up all night guiding her. Doyle, I, I think Fergus is her father. He's poisoned. What are you going to do? What do you mean? We well, certainly can't stay in the sanctuary. Molly wants nothing to do with it, and neither do I. Fergus is like my brother. There is no man I respect more. Now, I am sorry for what happened, for everyone. But if you can't live with Fergus, you can't live with us. You're a coward. What a pitiful coward. I should banish you with him. Oh, banish me? You earn your bloodlusting faithful. You don't deserve to be in this. Oh! These people have known too much suffering to be belittled by the likes of you. I want you gone. Tomorrow. I pity you. Are you all right? Lucas is not my father. Molly, my father left me when I was six years old. My mother was killed a year later. Like you, I was taken in by an older man. I wasn't taken in by Dora. I chose to be with him because I respect what he stands for. And what is that? Selflessness. Love of family. Rage. Cruelty. I've seen it before. The man who found me sold me to the Romans as a slave. You think it's easy for me to trust people? Doyle has had a difficult time since he lost his wife. Well... Your father, your real father, is having a difficult time, too. He only wants the chance to know you. And if he doesn't get it, we're afraid of what's going to happen to him. Doyle's leaving tomorrow. It's your last chance to talk with Fergus. I'd give anything to have that chance with my father. 